Hey, what's up guys? Second Kirby over here back again with another modern Minecraft tutorial. Oh yeah, so today's topic, the VAT from Ender.io. Now this is literally called the VAT. See, look at look and wheel it. It's literally called the VAT. So, anyway, the way the VAT works, this is and uh, this is a block from Ender.io that allows you to brew different fluids. So basically, let's get a test rack here. Um I'm gonna need uh, gonna need access to water, so copy that channel. But this thing needs to receive, receive only. Here we go. Now it has water. So, so the vat can make eight different kinds of fluids. So it can make nutrient distillation, hooch, rocket fuel, fire water, cloud seed, liquid sunshine, and concentrated cloud seed. That is seven. Okay, well, um, the last three fluids that I listed don't have a use. So concentrated cloud seed, cloud seed, and liquid sunshine don't have a use. But uh, I'm guessing liquid sunshine is like a like an alternate form of lighting. If anyone knows, let me know in the comments because I've never used liquid sunshine and there's no use for it in AI or in this version of Ender IO at least. Anyway, the vat uh, the vat is uh, uh, the vat is the only way to get nutrient distillation, which is which allows you to use the. Uh, uh, Ender IO inventory panel and uh, Hooch allows you to get rocket fuel. Rocket fuel is super important in Feed the Beast Infinity Evolved expert mode because rocket fuel is required to make plastic sheets, which is required to get into Mine Factory Reloaded automation. So basically, let's. Uh, oh, I should probably get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's. Oh, actually, it's in my inventory. What am I kidding? I have a creative energy cell in my inventory. So this thing needs both power and uh, this thing needs both power and a fluid in here, and it also needs two. It also needs two reagents. So, uh, so for nutrient distillation, for example, it needs a head of some kind or some kind of a some kind of byproduct from killing an animal, and then it needs like fermented spider eyes or sugar or mushrooms or nether wart. So for best, uh, so for the best results, I'm gonna put in. I'm gonna put in a creeper head and a fermented spider eye. Here we go. Once I put both, of, once I put both of these in here, uh, once I put both of these in here, the um, the vat uh, the vat takes the fluids, and it'll start processing the nutrient distillation in this example at least. So, what? So the vat uh, cannot be sped up by uh, by octet capacitors or double layer capacitors like other end IO machines. You have to accept you have to accept the speed that it goes, which is really hard if you're if you're doing under I or if you're doing infinity evolved when you need stuff done quickly so uh so i just put so i put in double i put in double uh i put in uh, i put in two reagents that had double the effect but if i put in only one reagent that has a single effect or if i put in one reagent that has a double effect 750 millibuckets would have been made Two reagents with one effect, so that would be five. Uh, that would be half a bucket. So, uh, so based on based on the based on the reagents that you put into the into the vat, you get more uh, you get more or less liquid out of it. Alrighty, so if you take a look at the recipe, the vat requires four electrical steel, two fluid tanks from Ender IO, which are which are glass of any kind, four iron bars and four iron, very inexpensive, a furnace. And a cauldron. Note that these recipes and these recipes may be different in Feed the Beast Infinity Vault. I know I know for a fact that electrical steel you cannot get until you get lumium. Alrighty. So, like I said, the vat the vat is useful for making nutrient distillation and rocket fuel. Is firewater used for anything? I don't know if firewater is used for anything. Give me a second. Firewater makes liquid sunshine. And that's pretty much it. Uh, wait. No, actually, that's not it. Some these fluids can also be used in uh, in an Ender IO uh, generator. I can't remember which one off the top of my head, but I can. Uh, let's see. Got it. The combustion engine. The combustion engine require uh, combustion engine requires some uh, some fuel from Ender IO. The uh, so uh, so the fuels uh, the the fluids that you brew in in the vats aren't entirely useless. So I mean. Rocket fuel, like I said, is useful in Feed the Beast Infinity Evolves for getting into uh, getting into Mine Factory Reloaded. But the, um, but the combustion generator can also use uh, rocket fuel to produce energy. So I'll 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 go over the combustion generator in a in a later tutorial. But uh, anyway, 
I think that'll be it for this episode of Modern Minecraft Tutorials. I hope you guys enjoyed a quick look at the VAT. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, feel free to leave a like or subscribe to my channel. It helps me out so very much. Also, if you want to see more tutorials in the future, let me know what you want to see. Post it in the comments, tweet it at me, or message it to me on Google+. Plus. No, mention me on Twitter or on Google+, or I might not see it. So that'll be it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Later!